All right, back at it. Thought I'd do another turn or two. See if I can get up to where I meant to be today. So we are in turn five of our 12 turn firefight. And where we left off, we had a grenade go off. We managed to make contact and we killed one enemy soldier. We have found an NCO running up north here and got a hit on him. He has a light wound and we knocked his morale down to normal. That's step one. Step two now is suppress him with suppressing fire, trying to knock his morale down to rout so that we can capture him, which would be step three. So, beginning our turn, we need to get to our hand and see what we got to work with here. Let's get rid of these old cards. All right, we'll pick one new card to see what we get. And it's in order they're up to something. We get an enemy event in addition to having this for our initiative. Charlie's got a 36, Abel's a 44, and Baker's a 70. Hmm. So our, our automatic weapons, our grease guns, have a 36 and a 44, which is pretty good, but not excellent. And then Baker coming up on the end. This is going to be our initiative card, and we've got to do an enemy order, or enemy event, excuse me. So there's actual special tables for firefight. Enemy event table. It's on page 19 in your rule book. All right, we roll a d10, and we roll a 2. Second thoughts. Immediately change one enemy order. Choose the closest to a friendly character. Then lowest character number. Then choose randomly. Pick a fresh order. Apply the order. Do not change the initiative order. If drawn during friendly card phase, then treat as six or seven below. Well, this is the friendly card phase, so six or seven below. More reinforcements. Well, isn't that special? We get five more on six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Do do do. Let's see. An enemy character will not arrive if occupied by a friendly character. Yeah. So we get more reinforcements. They're doubling down on us now, aren't they? All right, fine. Let's put them on. Enemy characters. So five, six, seven, Five more. I'll put them on top. I'm just not putting them on top so I can see what the heck I'm doing here. They're all going to be evades. They're all going to be bolds. All right, now let's figure out the directions. Okay, top guy. Top guy rolls a two, which is five, six. Next guy rolls a two, which is five six. Next guy rolls a two, which is five six. Next guy rolls. Can it be a two? No, it's a four. Five. And last guy rolls a three. Six five. Okay. Now we'll put them where they belong. Well, first we'll take those move orders off, indicators off of there. Uh, we'll put them where they belong. Oh, it's not going to help, is it? They're going to be moving again here. They go on top. There. All right.
take the move indicators off. Error. Okay. Got our card done. Now it's time for orders. This guy. Step two, suppress a fire. Because we got a seven. One, two, three, which is a plus one, so that'd be an eight. Minus two, seven, six, and there are no environmental or terrain order modifiers. So we're going to get lots of shots at him to try to knock him down. All right, I want an aim fire here. Hold the line, got a spot and try to take him out. These guys are going to be hiding yet. These guys are both going to be aim fires, just trying to hold the line down here. That's our orders. Let's get their orders. Yeah, I'll make this a little smaller. Don't need to see any detail. Get it out of the way. Okay. Top guy. Red. Normal in the open. Normal in the open. Running gun. 5-6. And he's got a low number. He's going to go first. He's going to get out of my line of sight. That's annoying. But he should run back into my line of sight. I'll still get a chance to suppress him in the open eventually. Okay. Running gun 5-6. Stop talking, Cliff, and just play. That's a red card. Okay. White, bold, in cover. Aim fire. That's a white card. Yellow, bold, in the open. Sneak, 1-6, or charge. He could charge. One, two, three, four. One. Closest guy big is Johnson. He's a four. Can he charge? Yeah. Fine. That's a grenade. Charge cliff. That's this one. Charge. Okay, that's my yellow card. Well, I get some shots at him before he gets to me. It's better than sneaking. For now. Okay, over here. Bold in the open. Bold in the open. Yellow. Aim fire. Bold in cover. Aim fire or charge. Too far away to charge. Aim fire. White. Bold. In cover. Rapid fire. Grenade. Yeah, he could try to grenade. Four. Yeah. Grenade. Bold. In cover. Rapid fire charge grenade. Four for the charge. Yep. Uh, bold in cover for the blue. Evade six five. He's plenty of trouble too. That's the blue card. This red guy bold in cover. Aim fire grenade. Close enough to grenade. 
grenade. Oh, is that all special? We got lots of charging and grenading and action all over the place. Now let's make this bigger so I can see what the heck I'm doing. Set up our initiative order. My best is only 36. We have two lower than that. It goes red, white. Red, white, Charlie Abel. Red, white, white, Charlie, Abel, then who? Abel's 44. Uh, Baker, blue, yellow. Red, white, Charlie Abel. And off we go. Red, running gun, five. Out of sight. All done, can't, no spotting to be done. Red. Grenade down here. All right, up in all these guys. This is a red. He's evading five. He's evading five. He's evading five. All right, that's red. White evading six. Evading five. Evading five. Evading six. And a charge. Boom. Wishing for a rapid fire right about now, but that ain't gonna happen. The charge is gonna get on top of me before I can do anything about it. We're gonna go into melee. Say oh, la vie. I hate melee. Charlie. Down here. Got an aim fire. Can't shoot. Nobody to spot. These guys are throwing from out of LOS. 
just pitching it through the hedgerows here at the bocage. So he's done. Abel. Express fire. Well, we cannot shoot, but we can try to spot. One, two, three, four. Six plus one is seven, charging in a field. Seven. Seven, just spots him. And he's a fairly decent soldier. So we'll probably want to do something about him, won't we now? Baker. He's done. This guy cannot see anybody. Too far away, so he's out of it. Aim fire can't shoot this turn, and he's got nobody to spot because that's too far away. Blue, yellow. Evade, six. I'm just having all sorts of fun down here. I can get a shot at him though, if I can get him spotted. Okay. This is getting ugly. Getting ugly. Blue, yellow. This is a blue here. Six. Yellow. It's going five. And this evade here is going six. Still a mosh pit. Yellow charge. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. Boom. Aim fire. Nothing. Aim fire, nothing. Okay. That's impulse one. Impulse two. Red, white, Charlie Abel, Baker. Red, white, cab. Red, gunning? Nope. So he goes six. More reds. This guy goes direction six. This guy goes direction five. This guy goes direction five. He doesn't need to move. No, he does need to move. To get up close enough. Red. Oh, 
wait. Oh. Direction six. Direction six. Direction six. Direction five. Aim fire. Grenade. It's moving up closer. Charge. In he goes. Melee. Going to be pitching two grenades in there and having a melee. That at Hex is just a busy place. I'm not so happy. All right, white. Charlie, right? Charlie and Abel. Charlie's down here. And it's a melee impulse, too. So I could do melee. Now I've got a seven. We're seven in melee, and I hit him. And I pull up my hand, and we killed him. Shit. He's pretty pissed off. All we gotta do is deal with those two grenades. All right. Discard that. This guy's killed. That stays. That stays. My aim fire is gone because I went into melee. I don't need that. Hit the right button, Cliff, would ya? Take that off of there. That stays. That charge is gone. Cleaning house here. That bold is gone. Stop doing that. We got that. The melee is gone. So we got our KIA. We got two grenades. And because I won, I get to duck back. I'm ducked back there, got rid of my order. And two KIAs for him with two grenades. One of them has LOS and one of them does not. We'll see what happens. Okay, and then up here, I've got a suppressive fire. Seven, one, two, three, it's eight, with no modifiers, three shots for eight. Um. I'm going to re-roll that and get rid of my re-roll here. No re-rolls left. Three morale checks here. Five minus one is four. 
four or less to pass. 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 Failed. He goes down one. That was suboptimal. And he becomes a duck back. So we stopped him. He's done. Top jam. All right. We've got an aim fire here. It's a firing impulse, but we got nobody spotted, but we can try to spot. One, two, three, four. Let me get up a little bit so we can see what the heck we're talking about here. We're looking here. We can spot him at four. We can spot him at three. They're both fine. All right. So he's got a five, six, evading and blocage. Evading. Come on, Cliff. I am here. And blocage. Minus one. And the grenade and blocage is still minus one. Okay, so he's a five, six, five for the evade here. Five to spot the evade, spotted. Another soldier and five, six, five to spot this grenade thrower. He spotted. Yeah, he's a soldier. So they're spotted. Cool. That's him. Done. There. Done. Up here, I've got an aim fire with a five. This is a plus one, is six. Charging in a field. Zero. And this is Johnson, my BAR, so two shots for six. Hits with a zero, hits with a five. With the zero, bad wound, the five, close call. So first of all, he gets to be bold. Not him. Silly. Him gets to be bold. He is going to lose that charge. Come a duck back. He's going to get a bad wound. All right, he's six, three, nine. Fails badly. Goes down three. One, two, three. Shaken. And then we had a close call morale check. Six minus five is one, zero or one. Huh. He goes down two more. He's routed with a bad wound. And on our confidence tracker, we killed another, one, two. And bad wound, routed. Well, there's a person to take prisoner. 
bad wound though. It's mean we're gonna sneak him back. It's slow, but it don't have very far to go. Alright. He's done. Let's back out of this a little ways now. Okay. So we got this guy who's stuck back. This guy who's stuck back. This is cautious. And this guy is bad wound. Cautious with a light wound is minus two, so he's three. We could charge him. We got enough of an advantage. I'm not too scared of him. Famous last words. Okay. Here we are. That's us. Blue, yellow. Blue. He's evading five. And blue down here, evading five. We're gonna end up back in melee. There's really not much way to stop this. I don't have a line of sight to him. Nasty hedges. Bocage. Blue, yellow. This guy's gonna evade six this time. This guy's going to evade five this time. And this guy's done. This guy's done. This guy goes to a hide. That's yellow. That's impulse two. Poof. Impulse three. Red, white, cab. Red, hide, evade, five. Evade, five. Evade, five. All the reds there. Grenade here. He's got a three. All right. It's been a while since I've done a grenade attack. Pull out the rules. Impulse one, arms grenade. Grenade marker on, target marker, yeah. Impulse two, single hex, yeah, we did that. Impulse three, throw the grenade up to a max of three. Grenade marker in. Okay, so. We're doing red. One, two, three. He's going to throw his grenade. And we gotta roll this. If it's nine, it's not. The grenade marker goes in there. Roll da da da. Okay, now we roll against his Grenade skill, which is a three. Six, so it's a grenade far. Okay, that's good. See, so he's done. That's red. White. 
All right, back to the top. White. He's going five. He's going five. He's going six. He's in fire. This guy's throwing a grenade. Gotta do a three. Three and three is six. He's still okay. This, this guy has got to be exposed now. He doesn't have a grenade. He can't do it. I removed too much. Take that off. I'm going to take that off. I don't know what I should have done here. I'm just going to change him to a duck back. I suppose I should expose these guys when I try to throw a grenade. Note to future self. Since I screwed up, he's just going to duck back there. He probably had like an aim fire or something, or a rapid fire, and he wouldn't be able to shoot anyway. So he can just sit there. Okay. That means these two target markers can come off. All right. That's white. Charlie. This grenade marker can come off. Stuck back. Goes to a hide. Up here, suppress a fire. We're going to try to suppress him more. This guy can't be seen now. He's hiding. So up here. Seven, eight, three shots for eight. Out of ammo. Isn't that sweet? Well, then this guy can just duck back. Gotta love those nines, folks. I made dice just for this occasion. Okay, he's done. Aim, fire. Well, we can't shoot at him. He's hiding now, isn't he? So he's done. And down here, one, two, three, four, we got a grenade there. We can shoot at what impulse is this? Three. You can't shoot, Cliff. You can only spot. No spotting. He's done. And he's of course done. And blue. Who's moving? Six. And blue, who is evading, 656. Six. And enters into melee. Okay. So he's there in melee. Blue. Finishing with yellow. He's moving five. He 
is moving six. He's aim fire. He's aim fire. He's hiding. And that's the end of that impulse. Last impulse of this turn. Red, white, CAB. Red, hiding. Red, evade five. Evade six. Evade five. Grenade doesn't need to do anything. He's just going to stay here. Because once he tosses that grenade, he can move if he wants. If it's in the open, but not if he's... Yeah. So he doesn't need to. He's in cover. All right, so he stays there. White. This guy is going to move six. This guy is going to move six. This guy is going to move six. This guy. Move six. Aim fire. Duck back. Comes a hide. See Charlie again. Seven. This guy's worse because he's bold and he's, yeah, got a six. Seven. Hits with a zero. A bad wound. Thank goodness. All right. This guy gets a bad wound. All right. So he's got a six minus three. Eight fails, goes down two. And I, because I was a zero, get to be bold. There we are. I'm bold. He's got a bad wound and cautious in melee. Well, I'm liking these odds better now. It was kind of dicey there. I still don't like having that grenade in the hex, but things could be a hell of a lot worse. Okay. Let's see, A, this guy goes to a hide. B. Impulse 4. Firing. Cannot fire because he's hiding. And he's too far away. Burn the grass. Burn the grass. Um, I want to fire at the grenade guy. 1, 2, 3, 4. So we got a six with a zero for distance. Minus three for the weather. It's a three. Grenade in bocage on the firing table. Okay. 
bocage minus two. Okay, six, three, one, zero, one. He's just a rifle, just a grand. Zero, one, seven. He's done. And of course, he's done. Blue, yellow. Move in six. And blue down here, melee. Six minus three minus four is two. Eight. <sighs> yellow. Mellow yellow. Six. And five. And aim fire. And aim fire. And a hide. And that is it. Um, when he enters into a hex with a grenade, I assume it's a grenade far. So these will both suffer from a grenade far attack. Because this is the end of the impulse. Well, let's do the grenade far attack. Mm, weapons. Their grenade. One for a two. For me, for him. Misses us both. All right, now we have three morale checks to take because it's for the grenade hex, whether you take injuries or not, and the adjacent. So him first, his six minus four is two, zero, one, or two. Seven fails his morale check. Um, so he goes down one. Shaken. My morale. And six, three. Morale checks don't get aren't affected by morale. Three. He still failed. Okay. Seven. For me. Four. I pass. And adjacent, five, fails. He's going to become cautious. And as a result, he's going to begin the next turn hiding. I will remove all the moves, remove all the orders. I'm going to put a hide on him right away. He's hiding. These guys remain in melee. He's out of ammo. This guy's light one and cautious. I'm going to have to be reloading in there. That or charge him outright and try to take him prisoner. Hmm, interesting thought. I shall cogitate upon that. We got a route here. We need to try to grab this guy. I could try to charge out there and grab him. With his bad wound, most he can do is kind of limp away with a 
sneak, evade. I can catch him with an evade. So I'm going to catch him. That'll be a prisoner down here. Yeah. So, oh yeah, our grenade went off. Yes. So where are all our grenade markers here? That's KIA. That's us. That grenade far is going to be gone now. I'm going to turn this into a smoke. I'll remove that. I need to put a smoke in there. This smoke flips to fading. And actually, let's clone them first. Put that smoke down here. Now I'll make this one fading. Now we got a smoke down here. We got a fading smoke there. Cool enough. All right. And I did all of the one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. Got another bad wound here, so that's another one down. We're getting close to breaking them. That'll keep them off our line. It'll also make it harder to get more prisoners. But, you know, how much do you really want to do? Anyway, enough muttering. I think I'm going to stop this video because who knows how long this one's been. And first, go to our turns. Put this back here. Advance to turn six. Take these off. Get up our display. Get rid of these cards. So that's done. That's it for turn five. We have not managed to capture a prisoner yet, but we are getting close to using our strategy to get them. We've killed a few, we've wounded a few. Thus far, we've been very, very lucky. It could have really gone horribly sideways, may still go sideways. We've been under fairly strong pressure, but we're making it. We'll see if we can pull this together. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.